The body of a Fort Campbell soldier who went missing while tubing on Kentucky Lake has been found. Lyon County, Kentucky emergency management officials say divers recovered the body earlier today. The soldier, whose name has not yet been released, went missing Friday afternoon and crews worked throughout the weekend to find him. Fort Campbell officials say he had been boating and swimming with friends when he went under. That soldier's death, the second drowning in just a couple of days. And first responders have also rescued four others from waterways. News Channel 5's Alexander Cohen rode along with the TWRA today to talk about water safety. To some people, this may look like a seat cushion, but it's actually a life saving device. You could throw this to someone in distress in the water and it could save them. On days like today, Percy Priest Lake is beautiful, but lately TWRA officers have been busy responding to emergencies. This is past weekend below the dam. There was a kayak incident where four people went into the water. Fortunately, they were all wearing life jackets and that is what saved their lives. While that family was rescued, that has not been the case with everyone. On Friday, 19 year old Corey Polk drowned in Percy Priest Lake near the dam. His mom told us he was trying to swim across the cove. A fisherman tried to get to the teen, but the current was too strong. For whatever reason, somebody finds their way into the water if they get ejected from a vessel. One of the main pieces of safety equipment that you can have other than your life jacket is a throw cushion. Swimmers stranded in the water can hold on to this flotation device until they are rescued. There's definitely a lot of current. You definitely want to be careful if you're out swimming. This time of year, there's not only swift water near the dam, but also the water is cold enough to take your breath away. Be prepared, you know, during this early part of summer for, you know, those cold waters and, you know, what you might experience when you do jump in. Unfortunately, there was also a drowning at Kentucky Lake Saturday. The body of a Fort Campbell soldier was recovered in the connecting river. The Tennessee River is a river system. It does. It can have strong current. It can have large waves. It's also important to monitor the weather. Wind can change currents and create waves instantly. Reporting from Percy Priest Lake, Alexander Cohen, News Channel 5. Thanks, Alexander. It's important to remember that children under the age of 12 are required by law to wear a life jacket while boating.